Hi everyone, this is Sanskrit for Tech Boys and today I'm gonna show you how you can use the new timeline feature introduced by Facebook before it is even released. Now Facebook introduced this feature around a couple of days ago and this feature looks quite promising to me uh, but I still actually doubt its efficiency and efficacy. So it, it would be a couple of months or weeks I guess before this uh, feature is officially introduced now if you want to sign up officially you can just uh, go here to facebook.com forward slash about forward slash timeline and uh, there you should see something uh, down below here like sign me up so just click and sign me up and uh, fill out uh, it's, it's, it would uh, show a notification that it will let you know as soon as it is ready and this would open only when you're signed up with your Facebook account so it will automatically detect your account now I'm going to show you how you can do that yourself uh, we have to go by first allowing the developer Facebook developer to get access to our account developers I, I'm, I'm really sorry <laughs> developers.facebook.com okay now we are seriously going to hack the graph as you can see there now here uh, if it asks you for a allowing the now if, if if you haven't already allowed this to get access to your account it will ask you for a notification allow or don't allow you have to allow this to use start using it the timeline feature now as you've done that you can see something like this at the same website developers.facebook.com forward slash apps now here on the top right corner you can see create new app we're seriously going to create a new app to hack the timeline I just click on create new app I'm gonna name it anything so that it's unique and uh, I'm gonna name it uh, tech boys streaming profile yeah I'm gonna namespace I'm gonna make it TV streaming pro stream pro yeah I'm going to agree to the platform privacy policy. I'm going to click on continue. And I would use the capture here to verify my identity. I'm going to click on submit. This might take a little time. And there you go. Now, the you can just fill it out. And in, to the left column, you just see open graph. I'm going to click on open graph and i'm going to see something like this now um in open graph you can see this uh, people can do this and uh, yeah so i'm going to make it a uh, read a uh, book yeah i'm going to click and get started okay. now after that if you have done that just go to facebook.com home.php that is to your profile home page as soon as you get back to the home page on your Facebook profile within a minute or two you should get an invitation to try have the new kind of profile that is using Tarmon now as soon as you click on get it now you will get the developer release of the Tarmon and you can see that this is listed and I have the new profile so uh, that's it this that's it for this tutorial I hope you liked this tutorial and was interesting so thanks for watching guys proud to be a tech boy and seriously try this this is awesome